What's up everybody, it is BernanaBird72 here, and welcome back to another Beyblade Burst unboxing and review. This one is on Morigna. And, uh, yeah, groin. That sounds really weird. I feel like I butchered that name. But, uh, yeah, these are burst, both Beyblade Burst Turbo Bays. I've been really looking forward to get the original Morigna, because I have the gray one right here. And it would be great for like comparison so, but that's for some other video but now let's get to the back these are all the statistics you need to know uh, I'm not gonna go over them because I to be honest I have no clue what some of them even mean but uh the gray one is a balance type and Rinya is a defense type and it comes with uh, the loop uh, driver, which which is pretty neato. I was wanting to get my hands on it on this one. So uh, let's get this bad boy open. Yeet. Yeah. Alright, here are the bays. Now uh, let's start over here with the gray one. This looks like it might have been an original trilogy bay. Or the original anime bay. But uh, I think this is Fusion, I believe. Not Excel. I made the mistake of doing that in uh, the Fafnir and Rudder review. I didn't look close enough at it. It was actually Fusion. I've got Fusion here now. So, it, and it comes with the four metal, which is uh, in modern times is a, is very outranked nowadays. But this is where the meat and potatoes are. This bay right here. It's a Hasbro exclusive. And it is sweet looking. I mean, I did model it after my custom bay. This is what my custom bay was modeled after. So, yeah. Bloop. Get in there. You little. Wow, okay. That's a pretty tight, pretty tight fit. How the heck do you, do you twist? Do. All right, I don't know how to activate the slingshot, so I'm gonna have to look in the instructions for that. But uh, these are the two bays. Now, uh, let's get to battling, shall we? Oh, and before I forget, here is the in-game statistics for both bays. Now we can actually get onto the battles. Okay. I did pre-launch these and yeah, pretty interesting. Three, two, one, go. That was a bad launch. Alright. Since that was a bad launch, you can hear it and launch it launch it again. But we're gonna go two with normal and then Two with the uh, slingshot. Three, two, one, go. Your wins. Good 
good. It's one, two, one. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Now to switch it up, twist it this way, and then I think it twists it again. This one is the same way, except in the opposite direction. Actually, come on. Yeah, it's hard to do for the first few times, but like once you do it, repeat it. You know what? I have one preset. It's still fusion, so. It's gonna be the same. Three, two, one, go. Oh dear. I think it might be my launcher. My launcher might be failing me. Right, we'll try that again. Three, two, one, go. That's better. What the heck? Marigna somehow reverted, even though I the song got reset it. There we go. You better stay that way this time. One win, one for Marigna. Three, two, one, go. Well now. One one fatal slap right in the right spot, and he burst. Yeah. I mean, he's definitely uh, the superior one in this pack. And now my personal opinion. Personally, it's all right. I mean, there are definitely other dual packs that are probably better. But uh, if you're getting it for Marigna, then it's unavoidable, unless someone on eBay is selling it separately. But look, what my biggest like thing is, is that the Fusion, the Slingshock Fusion drivers have such a loose fit, it's not even funny. I mean, it's like, it can be so annoying. And I like the Fusion driver, the original one that is, and I can't seem to find it anymore, and this is the only way to get them. So, overall, if I had to rate it out of 10, I'd say 5 out of 10. So, I hope I informed you enough and could guide you to an educated purchase. Other than that, live, like, subscribe, Bernard Edward 72. Bye-bye.